Let's say this is Jeff. This is David. Hi, David. Hi, Jeff. We are playing Dark Souls 2. 3. 3. Hooray. Whee. Uh, we are going after Vort. Vort. Did. Vort it. Vort it. Of yeah. the Boreal Valley. Right. Uh, this is the uh, quickest way there. So Although there's a, there's a lot of quick ways there. Why did where'd you get all this stuff? So all of this stuff. Well, the leather armor is actually from uh, everyone's favorite gray rat. But uh, the actual weapon we'll be using, which is the deep battle axe, you can get from a mimic in this area. Mm -hmm. So deep battle axe is a really really good weapon. Yes. It's uh, it's sort of a crutch in a lot of ways. Mm -hmm. But it's also just a weapon that does a lot of damage, so why not use it? <laughs> and you also got the east-west shield? Uh, that is, no, that is the, is it the silver kite uh, oh, shield? Oh, right, silver kite shield. Uh, That's I think it's it silver kite. It is a 100% blocking shield that is found in the uh, mm -hmm. same place that you get the key right. uh, for the Grey key. Rat. Right. Yeah, the cell key. All right. So this this is Vort, um, whose main features are being easy and also we'll ignore this first hit though because that was supposed to that was mistimed in right. the grossest way <laughs> just a little bit the uppercut is the easiest attack to avoid and punish mm -hmm. uh you just have to you know just kind of be near his right arm <laughs> and you'll be fine hey that didn't kill you nah i'm good i, I got my shield up it actually mm -hmm. plinked off my shield he yeah. does a lot of physical attacks. Right, right. So yeah, the lun the lunging attack he just did there was a is like a yeah, mm. a long range attack. So crossing distance and stuff. Right. But you just want to get up in his grill and be underneath him, basically, mm -hmm. or you know the classic Dark Souls, Souls one style of, uh, you know, getting <laughs> that butt. The fist bump. He's got a fist bump. Mm -hmm. uh, I actually did not bother categorizing every one of his moves because uh, in Dark Souls three, especially bosses have a whole bundle of different moves mm -hmm. that are slightly different than each other sometimes so they got a bushel so yeah a bu <laughs> sure uh they also mostly have this which is mm -hmm. some sort of indication of a phase change right. which the music changes uh and they become more aggressive or they add new spells or add new attacks in mm -hmm. this case his phase change starts with a charging attack right. where he'll uh, he'll kneel his head down and then mm -hmm. You know, try and charge at you. Um, he'll do it up to three times, but all you have to do is wait for his head to go down and then roll to the side. I just used my shield. I think that rolling to the side is a lot more awesome. Mm -hmm. You're right. <laughs> uh, and then he'll do the frost breath. You can actually mm. uh, stagger him out of the frost breath. It'll mm. give you frostbite, but frostbite is like the stupidest thing in the whole game because whatever. Oh, really? Yeah, it like, it, it supposedly makes you more... Or it reduces your damage resistance, so mm. yeah, like you take basically just damage. like a, a general debuff, right? But like, so <laughs> get I mean, good, don't get hit. Yeah, just yeah. don't get hit, or even if you do get hit, it doesn't really matter. Mm -hmm. uh, the scrape combo is the only one of importance, really, mm -hmm. on the second phase, other than trying to dodge the charge, mm -hmm. charge at frostbite, because he'll do two of them. Mm -hmm. So you wait for the first one, roll through the second one, punish, and then. If you just want to do it that way, you can end the fight pretty quickly. Mm -hmm. See, so, like, he's done it again. We'll just go ahead and, uh, yeah, finish it there. Punish him. So, Vort's actually pretty easy as long mm -hmm. as you're up close. That's, uh, not true of all the bosses, mm -hmm. but it is true of many bosses in all of the Dark Souls. Is, is, is. Mm -hmm. Right, right, right. So, now what are we going to see? Uh, now we're going to club him to death. Because <laughs> it was, like, way too short. <laughs> All right. Is this the same? Uh, I guess it would yeah, be the is, same. This is like the SL1 character, but we're, right. I'm, not, I'm not doing that for all of them. Right. <laughs> so this but is this SL1? guy's pretty easy. Yeah. This particular guy, I think I have not uh, done any uh, leveling on. Okay. He's just de deprived with two yeah, sticks. Yeah, it's just a deprived with the club. So you can't power stance at Dark Souls 3, right? No, you cannot. Okay. There are just certain weapons that are dual-wielded. Yes, that is true. Okay. Some weapons are double weapons. Okay. Where, where you don't have to get a second one of them, you just start with two of them mm -hmm. if you uh, two-hand them. <laughs> hey, you got your souls back. Hooray! How did this guy kill you? Um... It doesn't matter. I was I was probably just uh, I was probably just like distracted and mm -hmm. probably like 
uh, had to get a phone call to answer the door slash the, uh, there was a child that was like stuck in a tree outside and I was like oh I gotta go save the, the kid uh, Jeff you are not more, you are not that aware you are not that aware of your surroundings <laughs> so, some, of, some of that might not have happened <laughs> I'm gonna say all of that didn't happen. I'm just gonna say. Well, I, you know, we can agree to disagree. <laughs> the one I can see happening is a phone call, but depending on who it is, I can just see you ignoring it until you've beaten this boss. I get frostbitten. Oh no! <gasps> I thought that was a dot, so I was like super worried. And then you killed him. Yeah, he died. Mm -hmm. So passes Bort. Of the Boreal Valley. For a second, I thought you were just going to parry him. <laughs> Toe to tip. That's a port. That's a port. <laughs> <sighs> uh, what a dumb internet video. That is a great dumb internet video. Some might uh, say the best. Th next time, we'll be heading to the uh, Undead Settlement to fight whatever's there. Because I don't think you've actually got there yet. Nope. <laughs> okay, well, spoilers, there's a boss there. <laughs> okay. I, I figured, but I wasn't okay, sure. I was and like, I assumed she was fire-themed, but eh, maybe not. Well, who knows? We'll who find knows? out. We'll find we'll, out. Uh, you'll have to... Yeah, we'll see. We'll check in next time on our uh, Dark Souls 3 boss guide. <laughs> yeah. Yay. Also, since it's the PC version, it makes it very easy for uh, saving uh, backup saves. Mm -hmm. So I can just... <laughs> Yep. Retry things to get footage that I have missed, that kind of thing. Oh, I didn't there. even think of that. Yeah, because they used to be real, <laughs> real wonky with Dark Souls 2's PC version. It was just mm -hmm. like, mm -hmm. it's like, all right, it's saved in this folder ish. So go ahead and just back up this folder and then replace this folder. I was like, oh, okay. And then I did it as like, oh, it replaced everything. Okay. Uh, okay. All right. Well, can I transfer this to the new computer since the old one died? No. 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 Okay. Okay. So the perfectly legitimate uh, boss guides might be a little late, depending on how long it takes me to get back to those points. <laughs> sure. But, you know, but, you know, it's perfectly it's legitimate. legitimate. So, so a perfectly legitimate run naturally doesn't take as long. No, it's because I, I got good. And that's why mm -hmm. it's perfectly legitimate. Exactly. <laughs> Dark Souls. Dark Souls. That's kind of like the Sif fight. Oh, um, if you like what you just said. <laughs> Uh, and uh, yes, yes, this, we've entered the self-promotion section <laughs> right, right. of the, the after babble. Right. That, you know, most people don't hear, but for those of you who, are st who have stuck around, thank you. Uh, if you've liked what you've seen, uh, feel free to go visit our Patreon and uh, that's so you can pledge a certain amount a month and that makes it to where this is something that we can do so, uh, a lot more regularly, a lot more often, and we can do a wider variety of things. So, um, yep. and even if you just want to give like a buck a month, like that's, that's, that's a buck we weren't getting. And so you're awesome. 